All right. Now we're driving all three axes. We're running really slow to avoid damage. Don't want to break anything. There's a lot of work building this puppy. If you can see, the bellows system is working well. That's the air ram. It's got it tied the high end to the low end, so it acts like a glorified push-pull um, shock absorber. And it's carrying the extra load quite nicely. And it's able to eff effectively lift the entire robot. So It'll run about four times faster than what it's running right now when it's in production. Right now it's just uh, running a base routine for me. Well, I get things uh, tweaked in and I have to tune all the axes. Now, I still have to do the end effector, the gripper, and uh, uh, the leveling mechanism for the end. Two more axes. But this is primarily the robot arm complete without the end tooling. Furthermore, you can see that it's running on this software here. There is the program it's running on right there, written within this software. I'm going to be programming this to run on the Emotive headset, the mind control device. Um, I have the uh, Emotive uh, headset here, the pads, uh, and the software on this computer that I'll be driving the robot here. So stay tuned. That's next.